Well, hello everybody, welcome back to another episode on How to Find 4. We're back at the start screen again. Because I don't want to start immediately in the game itself. So, I'm gonna start uh, another How to Find game. I tried a little bit of, of, um, of no, no, not recording, and I did that French game. Um, I attacked Germany, I won against Germany. Japan was the only thing that was really bothering me. And then Germany declared war upon Belgium, the Netherlands and Luxembourg. And for some reason the Benelux joined the my faction, the the, Fra the, the Domination Française, I believe it was. And they still I they were in a war against me, so I can It was a little bit bugged out, so I didn't want to uh, continue that ma that game on my channel. But today we're going to be starting at the 1936 Brook Mark. Of course, dark times are coming in Europe. Hitler has consolidated his power, and his attention is now increasingly drawn beyond Germany's, bo Germany's borders. Mussolini's Italy continues to embark on daring military adventures. While the Empire of Japan stands poised to attack China and Asia, almost 20 years have passed since the end of the Great War, and the world has yet been, yet again been doused in gasoline. A single spark may be all it takes. And we're going to be playing as... Not as Japan, obviously, because I tried that and it ended up miserably. I didn't upload the last episode. That I recorded. I'm going to be playing as Italy. So the, the Italians with the rise of fascism, Italy has entered new glorious era. It, its forced, its forces are currently in the process of adding Ethiopia, Ethiopia to the growing Italian colonial empire. But Mussolini's ambitions do not stop there. Domin dominion over the Mediterranean has always been Italy's destiny, and the new order of of things is taking shape in Europe. When the tidal wave of change arrives, Italy must find a place at its crest of risk or risk being swept away. Uh, so they are fascists, of course, and they have a Futuria Mutilata. So basically, um, they won the Great War on the side of the Allies, and they the Allies were they were promised an, a piece of Anatolia, so Turkey. And, well, that did not happen, obviously. They only got roads and the islands, I mean. And this is the modifier for it. So, uh, acceptance of fascist diplomacy, acceptance of diplomacy, diplomacy, and things like that. And also, they have the king of the Great War still with them. So, that's a thing, select like this country. Um, we're going to be playing on recruit, of course, Iron Man mode on. I don't want to. Uh, Go stage scrubbing my dick off, and historical AI focus on for for um, so German Germany doesn't like lash out at other people. I saw them do that also in my French gameplay. Um, they were beaten completely. They still declared war on Netherlands and Belgium and Denmark and Norway and Austria and Yugoslavia and Romania and Bulgaria and Albania. No, Albania was already occupied, and like clearly they they all they did that all. I believe, wait, no. Well, they declared one Yugoslavia, that's for sure. That, that's why they joined my uh, faction. So, let's... Oh, wait. I chose France accidentally. Start. Iron Man Italy. I also tried a little bit of Italian gameplay to start off. I had a little, wanted a little bit of taste. I played it up until the um, beginning of 1939, I believe. And the war was about to break out. Uh, so what will we do? So we will to start off go down to Ethiopia. Italy starts off in a war against Ethiopia. I know if you didn't know yet. So get a front line. At these guys also a front line. There we go. Get these guys a leader. Get them a guy that doesn't have that much. Well, 
they start off a pretty crap leader, so it's good to start um, give a, give them a, a leader that is not that good at what he does. So he will go ahead and do it relatively easily. Addis Ababa, just go for Addis Ababa. There you go. Oh yeah, right. You just still need to do some things. Start off with um, a full construction line of the infantry equipment. Start building some civilian factories all across the Italian mainland. Also in there, there, and there we go. Um, that should keep them sweet for a while. So let's this. Um, let's them do one of those. Bam, 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 bam. Basically, stop this entire. So basically, what will happen is that the uh, battleship will finish. The um, dockyards will go over to the there's a second battleship. Go over to the light cruiser and things like that. So basically, all, everything will finish. No national focus set. Ethiopian war logistics. Um, no divisions and basic training. Get some. Divisione di Fanteria, or Infantry Division in English, to start um, training up. Get the basic uh, technologies, construction. Apparently, we don't have synthetic oil yet. Get industry, ele electronic mechanical engineering, and the sufficient resources. Get our oil from Venezuela. Get our rubber from the Netherlands, get our chromium from Turkey, everything's with no mission, I don't give a fuck, and yeah, that should be yeah, taken care of, and there we go, we shall go attack, now, don't know why they don't, they don't have a um, more troops in Somalia, I believe. Is this Somalia in real life? What is this called? Yeah, Somaliland, Somali, Somali, Somalia, whatever you want to call it. That's just feel got speed five. This war is not at all hard. The um, Ethiopia, Eo Ethiopia does not have that much to um, defend against you. They do not have um, a lot of troops. Well, they do have some troops, but they think they have less uh, experience, maybe, and less supplies and things like that, less technology than the powerful Italian ground forces, or whatever you want to call it. Don't know what that accent was, but I don't give a fuck. Let's just. Just make a fucking beeline for. Just make a fucking beeline for um, Addis Ababa. Nope. You just go forward. Attack Addis Ababa. <laughs> just like the sound of that. Addis Ababa. Addis Ababa. Addis Ababa. Shoot. Admit prioritization of Rhineland. Right. Industrial efforts. Oh, mission equipment production, artillery. Did anybody watch the um, trailer for uh, the new Battlefield game? That um, arti artillery just made thing of like that. Like um, reveal trailer, there's like those howitzers they fire. That was so fucking sick. Fucking hell! I don't have any fucking resources, do I? Ah. Uh. There we go, we've taken Addis Ababa. Addis Ababa. Addis Ababa. Addis Ababa. And to turn. There we go. If Ethiopia. Pass. 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 Sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry. So we've taken Ethiopia. Everything is well and okay. Apparently there's um, some bitches going on. Normally that isn't on there. Doom, 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 doom. Yeah, I'm done. There we go. Merge these two armies together. There we go. And 
get them to the Italian mainland right now because we are going to go to war with um, Yugoslavia in the future, not yet of course, because we want to keep the um, world tension lower than it uh, should be. Um, now, uh, go ahead and make some um, group. Um, blah, 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 blah. If great, you're taking care of that, that's for sure. Get them on the French, get some guys on the French border. Everybody should go on the French border because you have these other guys. And tanks will be in a separate army. So I can manually control them. They got General Albuleria, whatever his name is. Got Mountaineer, nice! Um, these guys. Oh, no. Didn't mean to do that. Um, now, give all of them should be assigned. Oh, they don't definitely have actually. Yeah. Go, all of them should be assigned. Oh, I didn't actually do it correctly. Also got the um, like the, uh, the buttons you can press to do things. For example, control is to assign units. Three really handy. Where's the front line unit? Um, Z. So this. No. Looks like this. There we go. Got it. I use an um, a Zerti, uh keyboard, so it basically means I constantly have to change my um, uh, keyboard uh, settings. It's easy because you just have to press um, shift alt together to change it, but still it's kind of annoying sometimes. And you're trying to play games and you know, I fuck I have the wrong two keyboard. Yeah. And will the um, election start? February. Oh, but they. Um, oh, we have some free military factories. Nice. When did they? Ethiopia had one military factory. Why was that war even worth it? Was that war even worth it? Like, seriously, guys. My god. One fucking. Okay, that was just stupid. Um. Research time, always nice to get that. We have some more uh, units over here. I'll keep them there. What the fuck is this shit? Oil and steel. Oil we will get from. Oh no, we are looking at steel from Germany, obviously. Those guys, they're our best pals. Venezuela, give me more oil, please. Oh, modify the government, nice. Apparently you don't have that much manpower. Why the fuck do we not have that much manpower? Limited exports, that is good. No, that, uh, that I don't need. Industrial concern. Boom. I still love the music in this game. Absolutely love it. I'm going to be playing um, historically. I'm going to join Germany. Things like that. Oh, we have some more uh, units over here. Nice. And then to that front. Oh, fuck. Oh, no, wait, I made a mistake. Get him at that front. To whatever this guy's name is. Ubaldo Sodu. And then Ubaldo, you bold fuck, you will get that front, I guess, those units. Is, is he actually bald? He's kind of balding, like he has that. Uh, he has a massive forehead. What's wrong with your forehead? Okay, that's just industrial effort. Very nice. Total of 140 days have already passed since the beginning of the game. Since the beginning of the game, I'm sorry. Should pronounce it better. Also, you should um, go ahead get all these bombers and fighters and basically all the air rings. Select them all because they're on these little fucking attack groups, and that's no use. Holy shit, that's loud. Let me just um, turn down my volume a little bit. It's way too loud. There we go. 
Is this better? Let's take a look. No, it's better. Just playing some Rainbow Six Siege and that game I turned my volume a little bit up. And it's not really that good for this game. If I will play in the reserve, you will we won't worry about that now. Um Navy Got all my my entire navy together because they're in these little fucking groups. I don't know why the game starts off like this. Make more harder, I guess. Have to actually like reform your navy before you before you send, can send it out. Well, I really don't understand why they do this. Imagine just like playing Hearts um, of Iron Four, the World War break out breaks out, and then you're like, oh fuck, I forgot to. Um, Use my uh, get my navy back in. Let me just get it, and like your navy is like all in Africa and things like that. And well, you can't get through here as long as um, England you owns this. So hey, <sighs> your navy is stuck as long as you don't get get this. We have some more units so in the south over here. Get them out to this bold fuck. Did you actually bold? I don't actually know. I don't know why I'm calling everybody bald fucks, but I don't give a fuck. Hey. Excavation. Yeah, okay, what is, what is, things, what is um, Hitler doing here? West Wall. Build some forts probably over this, over here, right? Not here. Correct. West Wall. I have 12 land forts on. So, Mosland and Württemberg. Württemberg and Mosland. Oh, so it is actually over here. 12 fronts on every. So basically. 3. Fronts in every. Um, 3. Um, bo What's they, what are they called? 3 forts. I forgot the name. Um, on every uh, province with the French border. Actually, I'm not really curious. What did I get? Out of the Ethiopians. One civilian factory and one military factory. <sighs> Again, was it worth it? Probably not. Modified the government. Material designer, we're not there yet. We'll keep that for later. Uh, let's get a material designer, I guess. Infantry equipment, sure. Not. Okay, let's just go ahead and do this. Boom, boom, boom. Industrial efforts. There you go, extra research slots. Very important. Three military factories. Four. That's more than the entirety of the. Uh, that's four times the um, Ethiopian war. Uh, I'm getting nothing out of the United States. I'm not going to trade with any possible democratic nation. That's why I'm getting my oil, uh, my oil out of Venezuela. I'm like, what do we actually have? Oh, that supply, resource. Yeah, they have a lot of. Holy shit, they have a lot of fucking things. How did they even get fascists? If somebody can tell me, go ahead. I don't fucking know why, how they. Would have gotten fascist. The Ethiopian war sure got, well, has gone a lot faster than the um, than my in my first run. I'll, in this this time I tried to um, we run um, merely tried to take the uh, capital. In the um, other play, uh, in the other game I tried. It took till the Spanish Civil War to them for them to fall. Oops, actually pa accidentally paused it. Well then, getting that extra research slot up and going. It's very nice. Now I'll go down to prospect for oil, liberty in the refineries, liberty in infrastructure. Well, I will, but won't do that yet. But Libyan refineries is really important because it will get me four more oil in Benghazi. Over here, it will only get me eight oil in Sirte. And I don't know where the fuck Sirte is, so. If you know it, 
go ahead and tell me, I guess. Get those oil plants. Where's Sirte? Is it down here? Oh, it's over here. That's interesting. Extra research slots or industrial expansion and other recent advances might allow us to conduct more R&D in parallel. Italian highways. Oh, there's a free research slot right now, so let's get radio. So, what are my plans in Yugoslavia going to be? Oh. So, basically, I'm planning on doing this. Meet up with um, Zara. Excuse me. Concentrated industry, very nice. If you are wondering why I'm really planning to go to war with um, Yugoslavia, I will show you right now. If you take a look in, in this part of the uh, uh, National Foci, you have tribes in Af Africa, and then you go and go ahead and claims on Yugoslavia, and then you have all this shit. And basically, if you you can go ahead and um, befriend Yugoslavia, get them on your side, but I do not advise that to anyone, and the reason why is because let me just first go ahead and get more democratic foreigner, prince of terror, fascist demagogue, compassionate gentleman, backroom backstapper, ideological crusader, smooth talking gen charmer, war industrialist. Oh, and that's nice. We're in Dutch list. Nice. Still waiting on the civil war to break out. So, um, why you would want to um, fuck over Yugoslavia is because if you take a look at resource map mode, they have aluminum, steel, of aluminum, chromium, a lot more chromium. We, we don't have that much chromium. We need more chromium. How many times did I now say chromium? I don't even know. Just like the sign of the word, chromium, yay. Let's get out. Um, Arteria will wait on, I will tell you that in a minute. Get the um, Mashi C200 Sayeta. A better airplane up and going. The reason why is because I can get discounts on those uh, things. If I go ahead and get over here artillery, one nice army, which will get me some support equipment. Um, Research bonuses, special forces, with, um, is the uh, marines and paratroopers, and oh, no, infantry, uh, well, mountain infantry and paratroopers. And armor will get me more research bonus, more armor uh, designs. So basically I want to army designs until I have those uh, modifiers. And I have some more units. Very nice. Assign to that guy, because he is clearly not prepared to fight the war. Oh, no. Yeah, there we go. Now, how is our production going? We are filled on that. Well, I'll keep that going, I guess. We are fully um, done. So, something I also did in the previous, if in the previous gameplay I did, in the previous game I did, was get a lot of Divisioni Alpina. Let me just train. I believe half an army should be good enough. Half an army in one go. And the rest of it will fill with their uh, divisions. Because this is really very um, mountainous, and I want to get that up and going as soon as possible, of course. I think in the last time I actually did that, um, that mountain infantry thingy, I actually got a. Um, I got more in the mountain infantry divisions. I got an entire army of mountain infantry, but that, by then I ran out, completely ran out of manpower, and that's not something you want before the war even started. So, 
I learned from my mistakes. Um, get support battalions. Um, shield hospitals. I believe that I don't get a modifier for that. And let's get some. Um, we could employ, change these Divisioni Alpina a little bit, edit them. Yeah, support artillery, engineer company. Um, well, let's take a look. What would happen if I added artillery? Organization would go down drastically, recovery rate would go uh, down, but that doesn't matter. Of course, it would uh, go down, you need more things to recover. Rate goes up, that does not matter. Supply does not matter. Combat width does not matter. Canada, of course, parrot would drop. There's the um, forest hills. What does this do? It gives you more forward attack. Oh, yeah, right. I don't have the next level of uh, artillery yet. Improved artillery, way better. The two artillery battalions in here. There we go. My infantry divisions will also get this. Anti-computer packs, I will join that. Edit. I should have re actually read it so you could see what it was. Get two guys of artillery in there. So basically, I will need more artillery production. Get this down a lot. Yeah, ooh, more prospect for a. Oh, yeah, I don't actually have them. Uh, Recruit and deploy. I need to give them a place to deploy. Still waiting on the Spanish Civil War. Come on, go off. I want you to go. Come on, Manuel Azena, with your butt, with your little thing in the in your chin. What do you call that in English? Dutchin? In Dutch, that's a Kontkin, but um, and Butkin is the exact uh, translation of that. But I don't actually know what of it. If it is like that, the um, word for that in English. So hey, if you want to tell me, go ahead. Get um, logistics company will be something for our war against the Soviet Union, but we are not there yet. Materials be something for later, air. Got heavy fighters, maybe. Oh no. Not 1938 yet. We are in 1937, so we can get improved machine tools, factory output, construction speeds. Hmm. Construction or fact. So basically, our factories or. Um, well. Get this. I think that will also um, benefit our military factories. Hmm. Like I think, like factory output is like something really fake. What are they working on? Industrial effort? Of course they are. Ah, prospect for oil. Oh, I don't. I haven't actually passed. What well, the friends go doing? Capital ship focus. They're going down the navy way. You should be going down the uh, political way because friends don't love it. We low national unity, and they can get rid of those um, negative modifiers. Use those modify the government again. We are going to. Can't one of our political advisors, core master general, armaments. No, that's not something I want. So we have back to construction speed and structure. Ah, uh, um, political power gain. That's something I want. No, who can I turn fascist? <laughs> um, 
Hungary has already fascist Czechoslovakia will get absorbed by Germany. Well, how about the Swedish? Turn them fascist, why don't they? And because there's a national um, historical AI focuses on, they won't do United Kingdom won't do his um, thingy over here with Scandinavian intervention because they can't. The um, that thing I ticked off doesn't allow them to. Get that construction thing going. Construction two. Prospect for oil. Get those living in the refineries. This does mean that we can import less oil. How is our um, construction going? Don't actually have enough to do an entire run of it. Support weapons, very nice, very nice. Um, I won't do this any yet. Um, Radar? Now, uh, they're working on army innovations. France working on defensive focus. Very nice. Home defense. Okay, that's good. Okay, then. Oh, some more units have dropped off to construction line. I guess training. Interesting. How fast are they turning fascist? Okay, that's going very well. So, we have finished the um, time Ethiopian War again. So, this is going to be it for the first episode of my Italian game, uh, play game, I guess. Um, if you enjoyed, just drop me a like, leave me those comments right down below. And if you're interested in more, of an autistic cunt playing uh, Hearts of Iron 4, just subscribe to this channel and I'll see you next time. Bye bye.